What's up everyone? So we have a new feature called Win by NeoVim. It's not yet released into the stable release. So if you are using 0.7, you will have to use the nightly build instead. Once you have done that, you can run your vim o win bar and assign it some text. As you can see, in the top of the window, you have a win bar with the text you have assigned. Obviously, this is customizable. You can do things like showing the file path you can see we have the file path what i want to do exactly is to show the file path but i want to customize it a little bit so let's head on to a configuration file i'll pick init file okay let's assign winbar i'm gonna assign it percentage open curly brace i'm gonna close the block using percentage uh, closing curly brace now to evaluate something here i'm going to pass in percentage v now we can write a command here we'll write call and lua and what we are going to do is make sure to not put a space here after lua period require then you can um, import a module in my case it's going to be in vim details and vim win and i'm going to call eval function within that module i don't have it right now but i will create it in a second so this is done now head on to win module pretty much empty i'm going to create a module um here i'm going to create a function called eval obviously then let's return something okay let me open up another window now we have a test as the win bar so that's working we're going to first get the file path now if you want to learn more about this syntax right here what you can retrieve you can go to help status uh, line scroll down so this is the one we are using make sure to pass it with percentage so that it knows um it's a special character not just f so um yeah we are getting the path from the current working directory then this is the full path there are ton of options you, you can use today we are going to use two first one is f obviously then we are going to use m or capital m that's the modified status okay um let me just run this so it returns a table and it contains a property called str which is what we want so let's access str same way let's get the modified status and obviously it's m here um let me just show you right now it has plus if i save the value meaning there are no modified changes it will just return an empty string so let's evaluate that if the text is equal to plus what i'm going to do is i'm going to return some text so let's head on to the browser and i'm going to search here circle and find some text this will do so this is the customization instead of plus i want to return a circle if that's not the case meaning there are no modifications just return empty string so we can return this but before that let me just uh, close and reopen because the uh, syntax highlighting is not working okay i'm going to stream format to placeholders then file path and modified okay that's being displayed now if i create a new line 
you can see the circle pops up exactly what I want um, okay now let's modify the four slashes in the file path to be something else something like an arrow so file path is equal to file path uh, G sub will search and replace four slashes with um, let's find some find an arrow I think this will do so paste it here um yeah that let me just add some space here so there we go but just to make it a little bit prettier let's add some highlights um here uh, we are going to define a new highlight group bin bar uh, it's called path you can call whatever you want then we are going to pass in highlights background should be um, I'm gonna pick a color then foreground or the text color will be something dark let's define one group for the uh, modified status as well then foreground i'm gonna set a red color okay even though you set some highlight groups it's not going to change anything here because we have to pass them into the win bar so um what we are going to do is we are going to start a new block um i mean this syntax looks weird but don't worry if you want to know something just head on to status line and go all the way or maybe you can search percentage hash for example um this is how you would pass in the highlights so everything is here percentage hash then the color group just to separate the color group and the text you have to uh, put another hash then the text file path now we need to end the block so this uh, whatever the text inside this block will be colored by bin bar path um, and to end the block percentage asterisk once again we have to display the modified status as well so i'll do Okay, this seems to be good let me close and reopen there we go now if i add a new line you can see we have a circle in red color um i mean i can really use some paddings around you know the circle and the wind bar and all that stuff but uh, pretty sure you can do that by yourself so this is it thanks for watching have a nice day